Assalamu alaikum, this is Fahim. Today I am going to solve this problem. Merge strings alternately. Sorry, merge strings alternately, which is a lit code problem 1768. And this problem is basically from the lit code 75 problem, if I am not mistaken. All right, lit code 75 from the famous lit code 75. Now, first of all, what I need to do, I need to read out the problem and try to understand what it wants to say. So, first of all, you are given two strings. Let's say the first string is word one and the second string is word two. Now, I can pretty much understand that these strings don't contain more than one word. All right. For example, word one contains only a single word as a string, and word two contains only one word as a string obviously now what i need to do i need to merge the strings by adding letters in alternating order starting with word one and if a string is longer than the other i have to append the additional letters onto the end of the merge string and lastly i have to return the merge string as simple as that all right so for the example example one here word one contains only abc and word two contains pqr and the resultant string contains apbqcr that means let's say i'm gonna add partitions in these two strings so word one contains a b and c if i break down all the letters in that string and word two contains p q and r if i break down this is string pqr all right now i need to take the first letter from the first string and then the first letter of the second string and i need to continue moving on like this so from word a the first letter of word a is a cool then the second word from the second word i have to take the first letter p so a p then I have to take the second letter from the first word and that is B and then I have to take the second letter from the second string that means Q and lastly I have to take the last or you can say the third letter from word 1 that is C and then I have to take the last or you can say the third letter from word 2 that is R. So that's how I have to merge two strings and if if one string appears larger than the other string i have to append the extra letters in my resultant string let's say for this example 2 word 1 contains ab and word 2 contains pqrs now i can see that word 2 is larger than word 1 so let me keep it simple shall we so first of all i need to add the first letter from the first string that is a all right then the first letter from the second string p cool now i need to take this second letter from the first string that is p and then i have to take this second letter from the second string that is q so a p b q cool now i have already finished everything from the word one i don't have any letter left in the word one but i still have two letters left in word two now what i need to do i need to simply append the extra letters in my resultant string that means i am simply appending rs directly to my resulting string and therefore i have to return apbq rs and i think i don't need to specify or you can say clarify example 3 because example 2 and example 3 are almost the same only the difference is that in example 2 my first word was smaller than the second word but in example 3 my first word is larger than the second word now obviously uh, i can see that word 2 contains two letter but word 1 contains four letters that means i am completing the entire word 2 as this is a smaller so a p and b q a p b q then i still have two letters left in the first string c d and i am simply appending them in my resultant string that's it so well i will solve this using c plus plus but if you can understand i'm sure that you can apply the same process in other places as well let me simply start the timer all right
they have provided me with a class solution public string the function name merge alternatively string word one string word two that means yeah first string is word one and the second string is word two all right now let's say first of all i have to identify the size of those string all right so let's say integer len gth length word one and then I can simply use the built-in function size. So let it be word one dot size like this. And I need to get the length for the second string as well. So integer len gth length for two, it would be word two dot size like this. So I have received the size of the two strings, and now I know which string is larger than other. All right now all right as i have to return a string i can simply declare a string let's say let me name it something like resultant string and firstly it would be simply an empty string because i haven't added anything in my resultant string yet but i will add now all right so uh let me simply declare to iterator variables let's say integer i and j i starts from zero and j also starts from zero obviously because this is the starting point of i string the index position starts from zero right and now i can simply use a while loop all right so while i is less than the length of the first string and j is also less than the length of the second string i have to do something as i have already told you that i have taken i for the word one and j for the word two so i am simply iterating all of the strings starting from zero number index all right so why i is less than length of word one and j is less than length of word two I have to what I need to do I need to merge the strings all together all right so now if let's say I less than I less than length sorry I less than length of word one because that means that my e string has not been finished yet I have still at least one letter left to merge from that string right so if i is still less than the length of word one that means if i still have anything left in my first string i need to push back in the resultant string all right so resultant string dot sorry push back i'm calling the pushback function tag obviously then what i need to push i need to push the letter from the first string like this okay and i need to do the same thing for the second string as well so if j i used j for the second string obviously i can keep i space here so like this if j is still less than the length of the first, second string what i need to do i need to add the letter now in my resultant string all right so resultant string dot push back sorry word now as I have entered the letter from the first string, now I need to enter the letter from the second string, obviously, because the sequence would be like this. So, word to J. Cool. And then, what I need to do, I have completed everything. Now I need to return the resultant string simply, as simple as that. So, return resultant string like this so this should finish our answer all right now before submitting it let me simply run it to see whether it works or not time limit exceeded all right time limit exceeded 
I have done a terrible mistake here because I need to increment the value because other than that I am not iterating the result at all because if I keep adding the exact same letter again and again how am I gonna finish the strings right so I have done the same mistake here as well this would be J++ and let's see accepted now it's time to submit it so that's it for today if you are new to this channel then you can consider subscribing to this channel and you can follow me in github, youtube, linkedin, facebook, twitter, instagram i'll provide all of the link in the description box so see you again